Punicha Granada, commonly known outside of science class as a pomegranate, and they are being called the newest superfood. They're heavy in antioxidants and credited with helping to reduce the risk of heart disease. Palm Wonderful, the company makes pomegranate drinks, and we're joined now by President and CEO Matt Tupper in Los Angeles. You know, Matt, I'll say, listen, I, I've heard about the benefits, although it seems like every few years there is a new superfood and then we don't hear from it again. Are pomegranates more permanent? Well, they're absolutely more permanent, Brian, uh, and thanks for having me. Uh, pomegranates have been, have been around for thousands of years, and uh, they've been a, an important part of medicine throughout the ages, so I don't think they're going anywhere in the next few years. All right, well, talk to us about the claims, heavy in antioxidants, credited at reducing heart disease. How much of a real benefit, though, are we talking about? And what's, you know, some of this food, you know, we're showing some of your bottles here, but some of this food, we say, well, it'll reduce your risk if you ingest, you know, seven pounds of it a day or something unnatural like that. <laughs> How much do you have to have? With pomegranate, the dose that's been shown to be effective is eight ounces a day. And what's actually unique among pomegranates uh, compared to all the other uh, of these so-called superfruits out there is that pomegranate is the one fruit that's actually been tested in human beings uh, by dozens of researchers across the globe. Uh, there's actually been a study published recently on prostate cancer, men suffering from advanced stages of prostate cancer. Uh, drinking eight ounces a day saw the progression of their prostate cancer actually slow dramatically. Um, in addition, there have been a number of studies published on cardiovascular disease uh, in which patients, patients again consuming eight ounces of pomegranate juice every day saw dramatic improvements in things like uh, atherosclerosis, which is plaque in the arteries, uh, the amount of blood flow delivered to the heart. So again, the, the difference here is that this is a product that's been tested in humans as opposed to uh, just tested in a, uh, a laboratory test tube. But Matt, when people go to buy this, I want to know how business is doing, but we've got, you've got to give credit to Linda Resnick, she, she's the real mastermind behind all this. She and her husband, Stuart, uh, among other businesses, own, own Teleflora, but it's really, this is her creation. And it was only because you grew pomegranates and she just decided, well, everybody should be drinking it. That's right, Stuart uh, and Linda are behind Palm Wonderful. They are my two bosses. And uh, the reason that we decided to make a huge planting of pomegranate trees back 10, 15 years ago when hardly anyone knew what a pomegranate was, uh, the reason that decision was made is because of the fundamental, unique, potent antioxidants in pomegranates that you can't find in any other fruits and vegetables. And over time, uh, the science has shown that these unique antioxidants, in fact, have some very special properties when, uh, when consumed by humans. But that was the vision that we had 10 years ago, and that's what led to uh, the birth and the growth of this business. Matt, how's business, though, in terms of sales? Because it has become a phenomenon in this country, but these little palms are pretty pricey. They were about five bucks a bottle, and you know, that's you know, a latte-grade price tag. <laughs> it's not cheap, but uh, you get what you pay for. That's true in general, and it's particularly true in pomegranates. They're actually a very uh, challenging fruit to grow. Uh, they consume lots of water, uh, which in here in California, at least, is a very scarce resource. Mm -hmm. They're all harvested by hand. Uh, and at least in the case of Palm, we have a series of uh, quality control programs in place that are really more akin to uh, pharmaceutical grade products than the food products. So you add it all up, and when you uh, consider that one of those 16 ounce bottles of juice has between four and five whole pomegranates in it, and you think about what does a pomegranate cost when you go and buy it in the supermarket, it's actually not such a bad deal. How many product applications do you think you can have? I was looking online, there's pomegranate tea, there's pomegranate juice, there's a lot of different pomegranate things. How many more products can you put out there and, and how much of it is just hooey, I think is a technical term for some of these products, you know, <laughs> pomegranate pills, et cetera? Well, you make a great point, Brian. Uh, there are services that track how many new products are introduced each year containing products, uh, containing pomegranate, excuse me. And that number reaches into the hundreds every year. There are candles and soaps and, and shampoos, and that's all fine and good. If people want to buy products that have the name pomegranate, they like the, the mythology and the history and the smell and the scent and the taste, that's fine. Uh, the products that we put into the market, though, uh, all stem from the fundamental science of the pomegranate. And everything that we put into the market, whether it's juice, whether it's tea, uh, whether it's the supplements that we sell, are all backed by uh, an enormous investment in science. We've actually funded more than $25 million of scientific research worldwide since we started the business and therefore every product that we 
uh, sell is backed by that science. Every product that we sell contains those unique antioxidants. Uh, we don't okay. do things for scents and flavors. Uh, we do them for the health benefits okay. and for the science. Matt, quickly, how fast are your sales growing? They're growing very quickly. In fact, uh, seven years ago when we started the business, it was literally a true startup uh, with zero business. And as we stand here today, uh, our business is well over $100 million. We're a private company. We don't ex uh, disclose precise financials, uh, but uh, it's been a, a truly extraordinary rise in a short period of time. All right, Matt Tupper, CEO and President of Palm Wonderful. Matt, we appreciate your time. Thanks very much for coming on. My pleasure. Thank you. All right, take care. If, if you want to uh, crack open a pomegranate, if you want to get the seeds out, you cut it in half, and then you beat the back of it with a spoon. Or you throw it at somebody and it stains. Pomegranate stain. It was a good, like, weapon as a kid, like an 8-year-old. You just kind of throw it at other 8-year-olds. It's awesome. Take us to break, Mike. Dagan, thank you very much. All right, coming up after the break, more in these markets. What is happening with the stock market, the price of oil?